secret estate in Wales, William and Kate, who inherit from Charles as their royal titles, made official. While Prince William and wife Kate Middleton have been referred to as the Prince and Princess of Wales after his father assumed the title of King Charles III upon the death of Queen Elizabeth II, those titles have actually been official until now. Those titles only became official earlier this month when the letters patent passed the Great Seal of the Realm on February 13th. With the death of Queen Elizabeth II, Prince William and Kate Middleton have become overnight billionaires besides gaining the new royal titles and responsibilities. It has now been revealed that Prince and Princess of Wales have also acquired a secret estate in a rural location in Wales. King Charles III had purchased a vast old estate located in the region of Cambridgeshire 15 years ago. The former Prince of Wales and his wife Queen Consort Camilla frequently stayed at the peaceful farmhouse and made friends with the villagers there. The Lywarner Mod estate house on the outskirts of Maidafi, close to Lagerre, was where King Charles and Camilla Queen Consort mostly stayed during St. David's Day each March. During this time, Charles would be concerned with the responsibilities primarily in Wales. Since the Queen's passing, residents of Amidoth have spoken fondly of the new king. They say he would attend church services on Sunday morning with a minimum of fanfare, donated prizes for local raffles, and also officially opened the new village hall. But some were concerned that he may now as monarch not have as many opportunities to visit his favorite part of Wales. It may be that the villagers have to switch their affection to the new prince and princess of Wales, William and Kate. With the title of Duke of Cornwall, Prince William now owns the Duchy of Cornwall, which is a private property created in 1337 by Edward III for his sons and heir Prince Edward to enjoy independence. As such, the Duke of Cornwall is always the eldest surviving son of the ruling monarch. With this in mind, Kensington Palace has confirmed that everything which forms part of the Duchy estate belongs to the Duchy of Cornwall. Hot on the heels of reports that Kay Middleton and Prince William are previously being gifted a massive mansion called Frogmore House on the Windsor estate, nope, not the same as Frogmore Cottage, there's a speculation that the couple is also set to inherit a very special Welsh home from King Charles. The mansion was built in 1684 and was the location of a Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's wedding reception, but don't confuse it with Harry and Meghan's UK home Frogmore Cottage, which is also on the Windsor estate. Also in the so-called Game of Homes property swap, it's likely that Prince William will be offered one of the King's Welsh properties called Lywarner Mond which is an old farmhouse purchased and renovated by Charles and Queen Consort Camilla in 2007. If William and Kate in do inherit it, it will be just one of their many properties aside from the Adelaide Cottage where they're currently living on the Windsor Estate. Will and Kate do have an apartment at Kensington Palace, a country home called Amner Hall, and a place at the Balmoral Estate they're also set to be moving into Windsor Castle proper in the next few years, and won't forget that Frogmore House is potentially also available to them. Under the shuffle, Charles could reportedly allow William and Kate to move into Windsor Castle. Charles is said to prefer other residences due to the Windsor position on the Heathrow flight path, making it too noisy. Though the move has not been confirmed by the Wales office, they have been regularly spotted on the estate since their children started at the nearby Lambrook School. Speculation over the relocation of the family from their London base of Kensington Palace to the Windsor area circulated earlier this year. As Lewis approached his fourth birthday and transaction from preschool to prep school, However, the new prince and princess of Wales are keen to hold off moving to Windsor Castle soon to avoid changing the children's lives in a quick succession. They love that the kids can go out on their bikes and cycle around the estate, and they are really excited to meet everyone. It's like a real little community. Anyway, if Kate and William need someone to house it, one of their many homes, I'm available.